Honorable Madam. Honorable Deputy Speaker, Parliament currently finds itself in the midst of a perfect storm. And that is why the image of the National Assembly needs to be restored. A perfect storm. But where did it come from? The Honourable Self, quite effectively this afternoon, gave one side of what happened. And that happened because of steps taken one after the other by the ANC in this Parliament to undermine the image of Parliament. He mentioned all of them. Those court cases, the manier waarop te werk gegaan word, een na die ander. Die probleem met die Parlement... <coughs> Het nie gekom in die vijfde parlement nie. Dit het reeds gekom in die vierde parlement. The Honorable de Disa this afternoon said oversight over the executive did not collapse. He did collapse when the president's question time was undermined. That is not when it collapsed. It already collapsed in the fourth parliament. When at the end of the fourth parliament, the ANC misused its majority to prevent the executive to be kept, taken to account in terms of what happened in Nkandla. To jylle die ad hoc komitee doodgedruk het aan die einde van die vierde parlement, daar het jylle reeds geval om die uitvoerende gezag verantwoordbaar te hou. Aan die ene kant het ons die ANC wat ons in hierdie situasie inbestuur het van die vierde parlement af. Aan die andere kant het ons met die EFF. Die EFF het tot stand gekom voor die 2014 verkiesing en baie duidelik hulle doel wat uitgespel. They said, we are coming to parliament to bring the revolution to parliament. They are on record by saying that. And that's exactly what they are doing at the moment. But they are the wrong place. Parliament, where does the word come from? It comes from the French word parler, to speak. This is a place where you're supposed to speak. We are supposed to convince people in terms of arguments. It's not supposed to be a place where you shout at people, where you talk down, and where you disrupt the proceedings. Maar die uitgangspunt van die EFF is om hierdie plek onregeerbaar te maak en die revolusie hierin te bring. And the question is basic, very easy. Should a party or a group of people be allowed to misuse democracy to destroy democracy? That's what the EFF wants to do. They want to disrupt. They want to disrupt the whole dispensation and the constitutional democracy. And it's no use to suspend them. It's no use to chuck them out of the house. The time has come to take away their salaries. I'm convinced that we have to take some money from their pockets every time that they do what they are doing in the house because they are disrupting parliament and they do not want to accept their responsibility. But the problem is, the problem is on the other side, we see what is happening. The ANC has the parliament in the stick to let the majority of the people to the president to protect that the Grand Wet Hof must ingrip and say, parliament acted unlawfully. That's what happened under your majority. The state time to say, parliament does not belong to the majority. Parliament is the highest institution on the legislative level. It belongs to all the people in Parliament, and all parties should be treated equally because we all represent the people out there. Yeah, that's why the term is over, sir.